What is going on everybody? Welcome back to another video in Gage's Garage and today we got a brand new project in store for you. Today we got our fat tire. I don't know what I'm going to call it for sure yet but it's just like a little mini bike but with a cooler like how I did the Boozer Cruiser. That's like a quad. I'm just making a mini bike out of it. Sitting the engine on above the wheel and having it like that and then having this whole rear swing arm separately attached from the cooler itself. So I'm going to build two parts to this frame. I'm going to have the whole rear swing arm completely separate and I'm going to have a pivot pivot points on the um, area where the cooler frame is going to be. So this cooler is just going to be able to slide down in, into this frame like the Boozer Cruisers, but I'm going to try and clean that up a little bit, make a little make it look a little better. And yeah, so just stay tuned. We got a lot we need to do and I'm trying to get it done so I can take it on vacations and stuff with me this summer. So I'm ex so excited for this thing. I got a six tooth sprocket that's going to go on the rear tire. So this thing's going to scoot. It's going to have a crap ton of torque. And uh, Jank bike, the first bike I ever built, that one had a 50 tooth sprocket and it had a crap ton of torque. So this one's got a lot more. This one's going to have even more torque, especially with how big these tires are and how little weight this thing is going to be. So yeah, stay tuned for this series and I hope you enjoy. Hey, like and subscribe and please share this with your friends. I'm trying to get this channel out there and yeah, just help me grow my channel with me. So just stay tuned and enjoy the video. Thank mm -hmm. Well, I ordered the wrong part uh, hub adapter for my sprocket, but I was able to drill some holes and it's the exact dimensions that I needed. So now I this um, hub right here fits on the sprocket perfectly. But the only other problem is go power sports sent me the hub with only three bolts and three nuts and didn't give me the fourth one. So I either got to buy one or tell them that they didn't send it, which I don't know. It's just unnecessary. I don't want to contact them because of one bolt. It's annoying, but I mean, I can fix it or I mean, I can find one. It's just annoying, but yeah, I got that fixed and I got those new holes drilled and now, yeah, it's a huge sprocket. <laughs> Okay, I got this temporarily huge axle on there because I couldn't really buy just sections of or the size axle I needed. So I just have to get a really big one and cut it and just save it because you can't really buy a keyed shaft that's not like 150 bucks anywhere. So I just got this one from Go Power Sports. I think it's like a 36 inch long one, but that was only like 40 or 50 bucks. So yeah, I got this one on here. I got a keyed. I just got to get, apparently this axle didn't come with keyways either. So I got to get the keyway for the inner hub as well as the uh, brake disc.
Yeah, I need it like how it is. Coming along, just gotta cut it now and get it on the front tire. because I didn't get much accomplished. I mean, I got this finished and I got the uh, front fork, like, um, I don't know, whatever you wanna call those, just like the front fork assembly, a part of it done. But that's all I got done in this video. I'm just gonna have to end it here because I have to get this video up tomorrow and I've been slacking on trying to upload every week. It's just been hard with being one person and doing everything. <laughs> so I'm just, trying to get this done as quick, as quick as I can but just stay tuned in the next couple of videos I'll have this thing up and running hopefully here soon I'll get the um, I'm gonna try to get the engine mounted next video as well as finishing this whole front fork assembly and I don't have my shocks yet because I still need to get those and I still have to design this cooler's frame that it's gonna sit in which I haven't done yet so just stay tuned and how we figure this thing out along the way I guess but I hope you enjoyed the video but that's going to be it for this video. Thank you all for watching. Like and subscribe and please share with your friends and family anything because I'm trying to get this, this channel out there. So like and subscribe. Thank you all for watching.